we're going to talk about one of our new products that is coming out. It's been on the blog. Make out an article. It's making the rounds. It's going to be shipping very soon. It is Cricut. And Cricut is our new low-cost robotics. Anything can be a robot. And uh, this is the board. Yes, yeah, this is a 3D model. We'll have these in the store very soon. And one of the goals is to make robot friends. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'll retell this story. Um, a million years ago, I was working on uh, these Curio robots uh, when I worked for an agency that uh, did the filming. We had to do some of the programming. And the Curios were these humanoid robots with dance around. And I, I later was able to post up footage because all those people aren't doing that anymore. And um, I would talk to one of the senior engineers, elderly uh, Sony engineer. Mm -hmm. And I said, oh, did you see the Asimov? It's like Asimov came out after. The, there was like a a race to have the humanoid robot that would go around the world and be like the brand ambassador. Yeah. And I said, well, you know, it, like, it's very different. Curio was about like reading to kids and it was your friend and it was a companion. It's a mm -hmm. robot friend. And the Asimov was more like uh, you, it would go do things for you, fetch your slippers, get you a drink, mm -hmm. um, get the paper, yeah. hold a gun. It didn't hold a gun. <laughs> but um, I said, what do you think of that? And he said, turn on, it's very important make robot friend not robot enemy don't make robot slave mm. and it really hit me because it's like wow what a neat approach so um years later we did this poster make robot friend and cricket is all about making robot friends these aren't really, not battle bots not like that's covered mm -hmm. these are robot friends art bots other types of bots so cricket can do a few things so i just wanted to go through some of the demos and some of the things that we've we've started to show first one uh jp got this this is just him testing it out he's the, our first beta tester making sure all the motors uh, he's doing all these projects um, and you'll see more and more guides soon. And other things, uh, if you wanted to do a very simple, you got a cardboard box, you got some paper, no problem. Other stuff. Um, very simple things, like if you just wanted to have a couple motors and just have uh, something like a, a, a car. Yeah. Go. Um, in this particular example, I put googly yeah, eyes on two motors, and those are the like the minions. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. these are experiments that we're doing here to make sure like everything's working out really good. Then there's ones where, what if you just you're an artist, or you're a young person, you yeah. like you like doing paintings, mm -hmm. or you like taking other people's paintings and doing stuff with it. Yeah. Um, well, you can make art that moves, and this was one example we did. Now, what if you um, order stuff from Amazon and you just have this Amazon box everywhere? It's like this is a perfect robot enclosure. Which is like enclosure. everybody's life. It's a perfect robot enclosure. You might not think that right now, but maybe you will soon. This is a trash panda. Now, what if you had a favorite movie from 1979 called Disney's Black Hole? <laughs> yeah. And it had a very this is getting obscure. <laughs> and it had a very touching scene with Vincent and Bob. Bob was the, the older robot. He was kind of a trash robot. And uh, it was one of the... I saw this when I was like four. And this yeah. is like my first experience oh. with like a robot dying. No, I can't make it. But um, you can remake just about any 1979 robot yeah. with Cricket. So animatronics, or as Walt Disney, as I was told, called them audio animatronics because mm -hmm. it is animatronics to do audio but uh, we made this is a little bit of a tribute video and it's also um, you can take uh, two plastic cups and do the eyeball movements from yeah. Vincent and Bob um, so here I'm going I'm to show the video Or if you're like all young people have like favorite music 
there's um, albums, there's new music videos, there's old music videos. And let's say if you're stuck in the 90s, let's say if you're a really fan of Nirvana's Heart Shaped Box in Utero and you're a fan of the director's cut version that came out not too long ago, well, you can make your own heart shaped box with crows and stuff like that. And uh, that's one of the things that that I did. And uh, here's the music video I made. And there's tons of things that you can do with 3D printing. There's tons of things you can do with really expensive electronics. But what if you just wanted to make a, a robotic hand and all you got is some straws and some cardboard? Well, we can lend a hand with that. Okay. There's a robot hand. Servo driven. Servo driven. And a new cricket to get okay. playground edition. And what does this mean? Handy. And last up, um, and this is the video I wanted to, to play, so you can do lots of advanced things with something very simple. Mm -hmm. So we have a soil detector, but you can also water the plants, churn, compost. We talked about that in the mm -hmm. show and tell. So I wanted to play uh, one video that goes along with this. This is uh, one of our latest videos that we did with Moo and Circuit uh, Python, and this is watering plants. We got one of those 4-H um, flower pots. It's springtime. It's springtime here at Adafruit and I just got my 4-H clover kits and I thought I'd take a shot at making a planting helper with my Circuit Playground Express. The Circuit Playground Express can detect capacitive touch which uh, is affected by soil mo moisture. So in this plant um, I have dry soil and so the LEDs are red letting me know that the plant needs to be watered. And then in this pot I have a plant with some damp soil so you can see if I move the sensor over, the LEDs will turn green. That lets me know that this plant does not need to be watered. And over the next week, as the soil dries out, the LEDs will turn red to let me know, hey, it's time to take care of this plant and water it a little bit more. And last up, this will probably be hitting the App Store for iOS devices. Yeah, I'll do some for Android. You know what the thing about the Android stuff is, I just want to say? Yeah. So every time we do an Android version of anything, no one says thank you. They, but leading up until that moment when we're working on it, everyone's like, you need an Android version. We're like, we're going to do one. Well, they also don't purchase them. But, well, well, no, this is the problem, though. If it, there's, not the, there's not the other side of the coin. Thanks yeah, for the Android. Never, the, yeah. It's like Android version. like, okay, we're talking about this iOS stuff right now. We already said we're going to do an Android version. You don't have to flood everything with Android version. When we do it, can you at least say, great Yay, Android, great acknowledged thing that's there. Anyways, yeah. so um, we have... Um, uh, a new app coming out. It's uh, an AR app, yeah. and uh, this is off my phone, hot off my phone. Um, we're in. This is from Test Flight because I had to test the app, and this is um, just part one of many, many parts. And by the way, all this stuff is going to work together with cardboard and everything that we do, and blah blah blah. But um, this one, you find a flat surface, and then you can put AdaBot anywhere. And once you put AdaBot, AdaBot does what AdaBot always likes to do: is dance around. Hey, I'm AdaBot. Um, you can make AdaBot bigger, small. Um, you put AdaBot back in the box. Um, but this is th just the first of many things that we're doing with AR. Yeah. Um, we wanted to have something fun and special for folks who have phones and like Adabot and want to start experimenting with this. So it's super uh, cool. Yeah. Uh, so check out our uh, blog probably this Friday or so, or if you're uh, in the app store, often just search for Adafruit. So with that, Lady Ada, 
That was our top secret. Get was, back in that vault. That was a lot. That vault is just jam-packed. Okay.